There are three different ways that materials can be moved in and out of cells so they obtain the nutrients they need and remove any harmful waste substances produced. Diffusion is the movement of solutes such as sugars and salts as well as gases from a region of high concentration to low concentration. In other words, molecules move from where there's more to where there's less until they're evenly spread out. This is how oxygen moves from the air into our lungs and then diffuses into the blood. Now, osmosis is a special type of diffusion that focuses on the movement of water molecules from a dilute solution to a more concentrated solution across a selectively permeable membrane. So water always moves from where there's more water to where there's less water. This is how plants get water from the soil into their roots. Now, osmosis and diffusion are both passive transport processes, which happen naturally without the need for energy. But with active transport, energy is required to get molecules moving against a concentration gradient from low to high concentration. This is how plants get their minerals from the soil. So remember, diffusion and osmosis move molecules from high to low concentration, while active transport moves molecules from low to high concentration.